I am Danielle Belton, the managing editor of The Root. The Root 100 represents the best and the brightest about our community. It's about people who aren't just like leaders in the fields of athletics and entertainment, but are leading in activism, community organizing, politics, law, tech, STEM. I mean, you name it, they do it. They're the boss at it, just as much as I'm a boss. We're all bosses at the Route 100. I feel that the Route 100 is very important. I think that we need to take this time every year to really acknowledge the people within our community who are doing amazing things. I am the host of the event, and I don't know how many people like declined this before they got to me, because I'm only at number 17, but I am the host for the evening. I love the Root because the Root represents us. We are so honored to be here tonight for the Root 100. You know, tap dance plays such an important part in American history and African American history. A lot of people don't know, but the first African American to perform on stage without blackface was Bilbo Jangles Robinson, a tap dancer. And so we are so honored to be here. To be here at the Route 100 is just, it's an honor for me. I think for a long time you look around and so many people on the list I have looked up to. And to be among them now is just insane. I love the Route because they keep it real. It's an honor to be among the top 100, under 45. We're trying to make a difference in this world. Great for the opportunity for the Route to recognize the work that we're doing. Who represents us? We have people in the foreground and the background. It tells our story, it tells it accurately, and it allows us to have a platform to be able to share our stories and what we're doing around the world with the greater masses. So we need The Root. I love The Root so much, it is my homepage. I read The Root before I read The New York Times or The Wall Street Journal or The Washington Post or Huffington Post or anything else. So you'll see on the list celebrities, uh, community leaders, academics, business people, and I think The Root really gets it and really takes a lot of time and energy into making sure that it's the right combination of those leaders who have made a difference this year. 